We heard from a number of voters carrying different concerns, some who made their polling places a frequent stop this year. In Montpelier and Roxbury, people were worried about both the forecasted property tax increase and the looming closure of the Roxbury Village School. That led to some voting no again, while others say they reluctantly voted yes just to end the madness. I hope this is a warning to the school board that another double digit increase probably will not withstand a, uh, a positive vote next year. I think a lot of the burden is with the legislature. There are things that they could do to uh, make burdens on local school, school districts better. The pressure of being put on small communities like Roxbury is very high. There's not a lot of money available. It has to stop climbing. You know, even from when I taught, uh, money does not make any child smarter. Take my select board hat off and just my citizen hat right now. I'm pretty disappointed in the leadership of the school board in the in the district. Really at no time did we feel that they really were fighting for Roxbury. Roxbury Select Board sued the school district two weeks ago trying to prevent this revote from happening, but a Vermont Superior Court judge ruled in favor of the district last week.